2024. It's our hack here. It's Monday night, even though it's the 1st of January. It is Monday night, so it's Monday night pause. It's your opportunity to pause and work on something on your business rather than working in your business. I'm Elle Hack and as an expert speaker, coach and facilitator, I've been helping small independent businesses for the last decade um, grow and prosper. Uh, I've got lots of strategies that have been proven across niches and as a dog groomer and dog trainer myself, um, my asset is working with canine professionals, particularly vet physios, um, people that are highly qualified, that have spent years doing um, the qualifications so that they can serve dogs and then get into business and go what's next during monday night pause i come to you real and raw this is not a staged training uh, this is me coming live to you every monday night to give you tools and tricks so that you can implement them in this week now going forwards um, so that you can grow your canine business. So, yeah, I'm plain faced. Yes, I'm coming to you from my bed instead of my desk because my room is surrounded in Christmas junk. <laughs> um, it's also been my son's first birthday uh, during this Christmas New Year period. Um, so it's been a fabulous wonderful family time but it is time to redirect and let's get focused for 2024 and to help you I want to tell you a story <laughs> I have a plant he is called Dave that's right Dave the plant um, I bought Dave when I was in Bristol and I got him from this wonderful little plant centre that's inside the um, containers down by the docks. Um, lovely, lovely, lovely facility. I bought him a few years ago and I bought him because he was on discount. So he's my discount Dave. <laughs> um, over the years he has, um, when one of the arms has come off, um, I've repotted it, shared it with my friends and there's multiple mini Daves or Dave 2s out in the world with my friends um, and isn't that similar to business um, if I use that as the example of like who I've supported in the canine world um, like when Kayla Harrison first came to me she'd never groomed before she'd worked in a supermarket and I trained her how to groom um, using the business strategies uh, that I implemented through my salon she went out and launched her own uh, family business uh, she does phenomenal she's now hired to be an ambassador of Christie's we're still very close friends and so like my little arm of knowledge um, got replanted in her and has grown into this incredible machine she is phenomenal I'm learning from her now like she is spot on um, so as you go through your business where are you adding value and sharing your knowledge and where can that knowledge go where it can flourish one of the tools here at Canine Care Hub is our 90 day resets and the other day I looked at Dave and he had so I'll put a picture <laughs> he had so many different arms coming off him I hadn't pruned him back I hadn't replanted him and shared that knowledge on anywhere um, and they were like fried. They he's a beautiful. I I'm actually not even sure what type of plant he is. So if you are a um, plant enthusiast and you're excited and you want to know what he is, I don't know. <laughs> you can tell me when I post the photo. Um, but he's gorgeous. He I'm looking at him now. He's um, he's got purple leaves with green stripes on it, and he, when he's vibrant, and he's gorgeous, and he's meant to flow and like hang down. Um, so he was hanging down in my bathroom and but then loads of the strings that had come off him were brown and crimpled and just dying just sad he looked very sad and 
I kind of been looking at him for the last few months. Um, my son is one, so I'm not a new mother anymore, but still I'm learning every day to be a better mum, and so therefore caring for my plants in the house have been very low down on the priority list. Keeping my son alive, very high. <laughs> looking after a canine client, very high. Um, so um, I was looking at him and I was like, right, today's the day. I'm going to sort this out. And this is a little bit like what we've just been gifted with. It's a new year. We've got the gift of resorting out our Daves, our businesses, and it's time, just like I had to, to trim some arms. So, where in your business right now are you spending energy on something that's not in your zone of genius? Where right now in your business are you not nourishing? Where are you not sharing your your knowledge, your beauty, your what the reason why people come to you as the canine expert? Where are you not sharing that right now? If you have a pen and paper, uh, start writing it down. Uh, we did a lovely um, process, my partner and I, on New Year's Eve. Uh, at half 11 I think it was we gave ourselves 4 minutes and we wrote down all of our achievements that we achieved in 2023 and then we started writing um, and, then, and then we shared that with one another it was lovely and then we wrote what would we like to achieve for 2024 uh, which is something we did when we first bought the house together and um, we one item away from ticking off every item on our house list um, so actually taking that time to reflect, so looking through my Dave plant, I had to reflect and I had to look at each branch individually and I, and I would say, okay, so who's healthy? Who needs to be trimmed back? Who needs to maybe be repotted and shared um, to a neighbour um, as a moving in gift, for example? Um, and that's exactly what I did. The final image of Dave um, looks less, I, not impressive because he was dead, like, before it was like this mass of information and leaves and networks. Afterwards, it was streamlined, he's got two or three beautifully hanging down, now luscious, arms. And this is it in business. Which arms in your business are created for you? Which arms make you thrive and will let all of your colours shine through like Dave's beautiful arms? And which arms are making you frazzle up inside and wilt away like his brown arms? Is there anything that you can trim either out of your business or out of your world that's not serving you right now? New year, new you doesn't need to be a new you. You just need to focus on your genius. Let your genius shine through. Let the colours come through on that genius. And let it serve and nourish you. Anything else that's actually draining you, that looks like a brown shriveled up leaf, like Dave's arm, get rid of. Or trim back. So is it a toxic person that you need to step back from? Is it a hobby that you thought was great and then you, is now maybe taking more energy and time than you thought it would. You know, you started, uh, I'm going to use this as an example because my best friend does it, you started bell ringing and you became the treasurer of the bell ringing. Like, is it this year that you step back and give away the treasurer title to somebody else? Yes, that was a very niche um, <laughs> example, but... If you've got a friend that's a bell ringer and a treasurer, why not use it? <laughs> um, and really, when it comes to 2020, 2024 and getting focused, it should almost be the same cycle as hopefully you have been, or if this is a new concept, then make sure we connect. It's the 90 day resets. Yes, we've got a brand new year to go and take over. 
But really, we should be living in 90 day worlds anyway. So, we get this new year feeling every three months, if done right. If you need support with a 90 day reset, or if you just need to jump on a call with me, um, and we can go through like what are the three things you need to do right now uh, to start elevating your business in 2024, or in this month, whenever you listen to this, um, make sure you reach out because I love serving you, I love helping you and I want to see you flourish and your beautiful uh, essence coming through like Dave the plant. <laughs> A huge huge happy new year. Um, and if you're going into it slightly less um, buzzed as other years, like me, as you can tell, I'm a bit frazzled from the old birthday and everything from my son. It's not because I had a crazy night out last night, I'm afraid to say. <laughs> it was a very lovely quiet night in. Um, then, this is your year. And if I can help you, I will. I'm not here to be flashy, I'm here to get you results. And results is what I am specialised for from the last decade across multiple niches so I know that the tactics and tools that we can implement in your business will get you results. It's always a pleasure to come with you on a journey on a Monday night. If you're listening back to this reach up in the sky and give yourself a pat on the back because you just took action and did something for your business just as the year started and I can't wait to see you on the next training I'm going to announce all the dates um, here in the group so I can't wait to see you on a training I can't wait to listen to you on a call and I'll post a photo of the lovely day below <laughs> have a fantastic rest of the evening I'm not going to lie I'll be heading to bed soon <laughs> always a pleasure see you next time